Adam Chandler here in Denver, Colorado, and in just a moment, I'm going to share with you the exact Facebook ad that generated 2,975 leads for my business. Uh, now, um, you know, the, 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 the bigger result that, that, that happened here was uh, uh, because those 2,975 leads uh, translated into a ton of signups, like automated signups uh, in my business, and tens of thousands of dollars in commissions from this one little ad. So uh, I'm going to share that ad with you in just a moment. Uh, but first, I'm going to show I'm, I'm going to share with you the principle and the psychology behind the message because that is the most important part. Because with something like Facebook ads and social media marketing, um, you know some of the, the 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 exact specific how to is going to change. You know the the specific technical aspects of the strategy that most people think is the answer. Is going, is going to change and evolve over time. However, if you understand the principle and the psychology behind the message, then you can adapt. You can, you can change regardless of the, the technical uh, strategies that might change and evolve over time that will, you know, six months from now, two years from now, you can use the principle that I'm talking about here and you, you can go out and you can crush it regardless of you know, if the technical, if the specific technical strategies have changed. Okay, so I'm going to share that with you. that. This this message is not about technical how to. This is about this is about pr principles and psychologies behind this. Now, I was on a training with a very successful Facebook marketer. You know, she's done a million, you know, millions of dollars. Um, and, you know, just on Facebook alone in the home business industry. And I was on a training with her, and she mentioned something. She said this. And I took it, I was like, wow, that's brilliant. I'm totally going to use that. She said, pretend like you're sitting next to a friend who's going through a tough time in their life right now. You have your arm around them and you're giving them advice about how to solve their problem, right? And you're basically saying, I used to be like you. I used to have this problem too, right? Then I found this, okay? It's freaking magical, okay, when you really grasp this concept. Uh, like, like, and you put it into action like I did. Um, so here's the ad uh, itself. So home, you, you've probably, there's a good chance you saw this because I ran this ad for a good portion of, 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 of last year and that was when the majority of the results for this particular ad, you know, came in was in 2014. But here it is, home business suckville, question mark. And, uh, you know, it's basically saying suckville, like, you know, is your, are you in suckville with your home business? Does, you know, does, does your life suck because your business just, is just creeping along, right? So then, so home business Suckville question mark. I was in Suckville too. So I've got my arm around the friend, right? I was in Suckville too. Then I found this blueprint for seven thousand five hundred and thirty-two dollars per month with video marketing. Um, now, this this can be used. This promise, you know, can really be used. Like I said, because this is the principle. The principle is you've got your arm around their friend and you're saying, I used to have this problem too. Then I found this. You don't even have to have the result yet. You just have to say, then I found the blueprint, right? So if you're promoting weight loss, you know, it's like, do you hate the way you look? Question mark. I used to hate the way I look too. Then I found this blueprint for, you know, losing 25 pounds in, you know, five days or something like that. Whatever, whatever, whatever it happens to be, that's probably not, you know, an accurate for weight loss. I'm just giving the example. What about if you're promoting lead generation, right? So it's like, I, I you know, uh, struggling to get leads for your business, question mark. I used to struggle to get leads too. Then I found this blueprint for 25 leads a day, right? And then I found this blueprint for more leads and, and, and sales for my business. Right, so this this it, that's what I'm saying. You understand the principle, and you can and you can adapt this, and you can make it work to your own message. Isn't that cool? So, um, so and then another thing I want to mention. You know, this was the ad, or this was the page that they went to. Um, you know, when so how you cash on, in on the mobile revolution in 2014. Remember, the majority of this, you know, the results from this ad came in 2014, and get to seven five three two per month with less than 100 customers. So they, when they clicked on the ad, they would get to this page or some variation of this page. And the only reason I mention that is to show you how congruent the page is with the message. And that's something, that's another really important principle that you've got to take away from this video is that 
the the con you've got to be congruent. It's like the 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 advertisement. This ad is going to be making a promise. Okay, when they get to the when they take the action, which in this case is going to the that website, you have to fulfill on that promise. I see marketers screw this up all the time, and it, it kills conversions. So it's got to be very congruent. Now let's break down this ad just a little bit. So you've got the headline, a simple attention-getting headline in the form of a question. Home business suckville, question mark. Struggling to get leads for your business, question mark. Do you hate the way you look, question mark. Simple attention-getting headline in the form of a question. Then the promise, promise of what they will get when they take action. So in this case, you know, I was in suckville too. Then I found this blueprint. And I, you know, just again, you don't even have to have the result. You just have to have found the blueprint. Okay, you want them thinking, wow, this person, like, like we have the same problem. They solved this problem for them. So they found the blueprint. It's pretty cool. And then the image, a non-salesy image that makes them drop their guard when they see it in their newsfeed. So look at this image. It's not something, you know, this would is just an, an image that they would see in their Facebook newsfeed. It doesn't send a whole bunch of radars off like this is a sales message the way that a lot of advertisements do. When, when a, an advertisement is too salesy, especially on something like Facebook where they're not, they're not expecting ads, they don't want ads, right? If the message is too salesy, they're gonna, it's going to kill it. You know, they're, they're going to they're gonna go away, right? They're, they're not even going to see the ad. They're blind to it, right? So you've got you've to make it blend in and this picture is a really good example of making it blend in. I've got, you know, I'm sitting, you know, you've got palm trees behind me, there's lifestyle, you know, in the in the in the image. And and I'll mention too, this 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 picture was very deliberate. I was sitting at a pool at a resort in Florida and I was re I was reading this book and I was like and I told my friend, hey, will you take a picture of me with this? I'm gonna use it in an ad. <laughs> I'm gonna use it in a Facebook ad. It was very deliberate because I have opportunity seeking perception. I I, I I, I, I think like that and you should too. You should be opportunistic like that as well um, you know if you if you really want to you know have have bigger results in your business. So that's kind of the breakdown of the ad. Again, you got so many important principles to take away here. Um, so let's review some of these important principles that we talked about. Pretend like you're sitting next to a friend giving them advice on how to solve their problem. Number two, make the message as non-salesy as possible so that they drop their guard and pay more attention. Very important with Facebook ads and social media marketing. It's got to blend in, you know, a little bit with, and, and I say blend in. I mean, it, it shouldn't blend in. It should stand out, but it should, it should, uh, it, it, it should be non-salesy. It should, it should be like something else that they might see in their news feed so that they drop their guard and pay more attention to the message. And then keep the message of the ad as congruent as possible to the message that they're going to get when they hit the website. Again, I see marketers screw this up all the time, uh, and it's it, it kills conversions. So it's got to be really, really congruent from the promise that you make in the ad to when they hit the website, you fulfill on the promise. Make sense? Okay. So uh, coming soon, my all-new List Leverage free video training series uh, reveals how I generated 5,811 leads, recruited 166 new reps uh, in 12 months without even picking up the phone. So this is a free video series that is coming uh, very soon where I'm going to dive more, you know, very more specific into these strategies and how to use, you know, Facebook ads and other, uh, you know, other advertising strategies to build a huge list, to create some real leverage and speed to results in your business. So be on the lookout uh, for that. Uh, and if you really want to make sure that you don't miss out on this free video series, um, I've, I've created a waiting list where you're going to be the first ones to be notified when this free video series launches. Um, you know, if generating more leads and, uh, you know, building a bigger business is important to you, go to meetadamchandler.com forward slash list. Again, that's meetadamchandler.com forward slash list to get on the waiting list uh, to be notified as soon as this uh, video training series comes out very soon. Now, if you got uh, value from this video, uh, leave me a comment below. Share it around if you think that uh, others will get value from uh, this training as well. And uh, I hope you hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you on the next one. Take care.